Ladies and gentlemen, they like me. Crazy people, we're talking here. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, Howie Combo. My name is Howard Campbell. I've been doing stand up philosophy since I was 14. So pardon me while I channel Bill Baker, plaster a smile on my face, and plow through this shit one more time. If I have a little bit of an edge in my voice, it's because this morning at about 2.30 I was cure gassed. And the performance I'm about to do right now is inspired by that notion and what I've seen on Fox Television in terms of their reporting. What I brought today with me is a Fox News deck of playing cards, which as you know, of course, would be fair and balanced. So what I want to do is, is look at the metaphor of the pack of playing cards in terms of the stories that they had on Fox News. That's how Fox News presents itself, yes, it's fair and balanced. So this is a fair and balanced deck of playing cards. You can see that all the cards are different. Just like on Fox News, they present it as if all the stories are different. But when I watch Fox, Fox News, I hear something in the background when they're covering the occupation stories. What I hear in the background is that the protesters are wrong. In order to make this metaphor work, what I'm going to ask is one of these beautiful young ladies, would you mind helping me? <laughs> sir, sir, I'll take the first volunteer. Sir, sir what is your name? Amy, are you willing to come up Come on. If you, would, if you would, I'd be great. Because the microphone is here, and without the microphone, it is not trivia. What I'd like you to do is to uh, select one card that's going to represent the idea that the protesters are wrong. Which card do you want? No, don't take the very long. Because we've all seen what it is. Well, okay, but the other people have to touch a plank. That one right there? Go for it. Take it. You got it? What is it? What is the card that works? Yeah, because in order to make this make a work, it's a good card. Is it? Oh, fuck, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter if I, if I see it or not. It? No, it's, I understand. Thank you for sharing that. I wouldn't have known if it was my trick without your mention. But that's fantastic. So the idea is whatever card you guys just saw represents the idea that the protesters are wrong, yeah? That was the point. I thought, awesome. So within all the different stories that they show, the idea, if the idea is, as it appears to me, that the protesters are wrong, then what I want you to do is touch another playing card, just touch a card. The, the very top one. And, and so if my theory is right, what would this card be? What was your card? What was your card? My, my theory was that whatever story we have, that it, the ace of spades. Well, this just happens to be. Okay. We're going to try this against the sense of redundancy. Could be anyone to make the entire audience a plot, but when you can get one person, you're an artist. <laughs> Not really. All right, let's try this again. Touch another playing card, focus on touch a card. That one right here, any idea what you're playing card It's, of course, the ace of spades. Here, we're going to bring this down to a, a, a quick and resolving end where you should get the, the camera up here real close. Because when you look at Fox News at the end of the day, what they're actually saying is the protesters are wrong, the protesters are wrong, the protesters are wrong. If you enjoyed the show, my name is Howard Campbell, and if you didn't, it's Ben Mack. Thanks for your time.